25 minute zero increment game. It's a bit longer, a bit longer time to think. So I'm bringing the knight, supporting the pawn. So Bishop's going to be doing the Fianchetto thing. We do think the Fianchetto is a little bit slow, but we shall see. Just develop the Bishop. So it looks like they're going to be a sit and wait type player looking for us to overextend with this Fianchetto style. Just going to open up the dark square bishop. See if we can get castled on the king side as we do. Let's just take the pawn. Don't need to kind of deliberate over that. So we're plus one at the minute. We could allow them just to catch the capture the pawn back, but we do have another piece that can capture it back if need be. If the knight takes, knight can take. If the bishop takes, bishop can take. So it seems to be like even. Okay, so knight's coming down, it's looking maybe here, it can go here as well. Do we have anything else, seeing as they're not taking the pawn back? Don't want to rush around trying to save the pawn. Probably need to make space for our castling. So preventing the knight from actually taking the pawn. I'm going to take the knight off the board. And then castle. So it looks like the opponents allowed us to keep the pawn. But we're more interested in position on the board rather than being plus ones and stuff like that. So it's got double situation here. This pawn doesn't have any protection, but how do we get to it? Knight's in. Do we need to get our knight out? Is it going to be functional for us? Where's he going with his knight? Do, 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 do. If we go here, pushes. I think this knight looks better going here to here. It's got space here. So I think coming in, out, here, some sort of plan with this knight looks a lot better. King's got company at the minute. It's got the bishop, knight. Probably not going to stay there for too long. Not yet, though. Queen's the only one protecting. So I'm curious, where's this knight actually planning to go? Is he attacking our knight? Supporting the pawn with the queen. Could hit the knight with the pawn. Attacks our knight, I suppose. Gets his queen closer towards our king, Gary. It's a bit scary, isn't it? Gonna hit the knight. Smaller piece attacking a higher piece. That's what's made me make that decision. Positionally, it doesn't feel too bad. I think we can weather the storm if he does come here. We don't have to actually take. <laughs> it does go there as well. Right, so let's have a look at the situation. Bishop can come here to attack the queen. But he does have knight check. And we do have a replication knight. So it might work in our favour. Let's attack the queen. A smaller piece attacking a higher piece again. That's what's helped make that decision. And also the fact of having a replication knight here. 
if this knight wasn't here, we wouldn't have been able to get away with it because his knight would have just taken, then our bishop would have been taken by the queen. So I don't think the knight, well, he can because he's got a check on the king, like we said. So that's probably the move they're going to make. Yeah, so we take with the replication. Do they hit the, the pawn here? Maybe. No, I, I don't think so. Queen's moving. Queen's moving off the line. Do we have anything else after that? Got two on one on the pawn, so the queen could actually take. But before we take, it takes, if the queen takes, then the knight takes, then the bishop takes the pawn. And it's on this pawn as well. Knight can take this pawn. Bishop takes this pawn, is on the rook. Rook comes here. So let's have a look at that then. Are we down then? Or is it equalised again? We're plus one at the moment. Queen goes for a take. So there will be plus two. Queen takes. Knight takes. Bishop takes. So then we're plus one. Knight takes. Then he gets the plus one back. Is that any good? And then we've got the bishop and knight thing. Knight comes here, but that doesn't look meaty enough, does it? So if we take with the knight, he still gets the pawn, doesn't he? Ooh. Equalizing, equalizing. Could have just attacked the bishop. Yep. Get the bishop out of the picture. Yeah, let's attack the bishop, get it out of the picture. That's the one that's winning all the pawns, isn't it? And then we can look at doing the exchange. Don't, not saying he's going to take with the queen anyway, but, you know, we're trying to do some sort of calculation thing here, reverse calculation. So reverse calculation in our world is basically looking at the picture as, well, that's how it would look. So can we do something to stop that? And it looks like this person's left the game. Or maybe they were looking at the beautiful picture of the Queen Exchange, etc. and winning the pawns back. I don't think it was a drastically winning situation, though. Could just take, takes. Oh, he's gone for it. Okay. Right, maybe a bad connection. Let's take. Does the queen come running for the pawn rather than saving this pawn? Or does this pawn just drop? No, the rook's coming for the pawn. Wow, oh, right, okay. So, we're plus one. Queen takes. Say the queen takes. The knight takes. If the rook comes down, it's going to be on this pawn as well. We take this pawn. He takes this pawn, he's on the knight. We attack, we're on his pawn, but the bishop's protecting. Okay, maybe the knight just takes now. Or maybe we'll just take our time, but the thing is, his rook's going to come and defend, isn't it? Come here. Let's go basic again. It just doesn't want us to get this pawn, so this pawn's going to come and protect it, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, very good. So the queen's coming for the pawn. It's going to push. 
I don't think I needed to put too much thought into that. We discussed that briefly, didn't we? Um, we still have this pawn here, but this pawn can come down to protect it. Could hit it. It's wanting to get castled. Oh, the queen's coming back again. So if we take, it's, what's his position like? It looks the same. I think we get the pawn this time. We get the pawn this time. And he doesn't have to exchange, he could just fly all the way across here or something, or here. <laughs> oh, exact move. Damn. Okay, right, so the king is there, still not got castled. Our queen can't quite get to it. Could look to double up the situation and then get the queen here, but he'll, he will have castled by then. Jump the knight here. Hitting this rook will be there. Can't get to that queen king. Okay, just bring the rook across. Then he has to castle. I mean, that's a dangerous square actually, as well, because our queen can come here, here, and here. So he'll have to probably drop this pawn. And with their queen being on the other side of the board, oh, they're not moving it. Oh, but they've saved it because the rook is, um, that's a bit annoying. It's attacking a pawn. Let's push this pawn up. So we have an, a vision of coming round here, round here, if he castles somehow. It's just attacking. Uh, but then the rooks are, yeah, okay, the rooks here, the knight's defending. I'm just thinking if he goes castling, the queen's going to have to do a single roam. So the bishop's in a, it's all by itself, it's not really supported. So you'd think it would go back again. I don't know how this player's thinking, it's just got his queen over here, he's got his rook here, king's in the center of the board, you'd be thinking they'd be castling. I think they've had a few opportunities to castle, haven't they? So we could, I don't really want to over it. Because this would be nice, but his queen is there, you know, to just go here, bang. So we could, no, we can't get it off because it'll be, it'll just sit there. So how do we get the queen to move without losing our queen? Can we go here? Oh, the pawn's there. We can't even go here because the bishop's there. Hit the bishop. See what he wants to do. Goes back. But it's blocking the queen's passageway, you see, to come up here. Anyway, I'm going to hit the bishop. Not that it makes much difference because it's still managing the square. But if it goes there, we can actually go with the queen and that'll be a checkmate. Oh, sad times. Excellent session. That'll be it for now.